If I think back to like two, three years ago, I never thought I'd be in this position now, making a video saying that I'm finally done school. Now, I just want to give a little bit of a backstory. Of course, I did primary school all the way through. Then I went into secondary school. So we had first year, which I did like eight or nine months of because obviously quarantine came on, COVID-19, whatever. Big scamdemic. Of course, I wasn't complaining because I had no school. They wanted us to wear masks, but I didn't wear a mask and I didn't even go into school during that time period. This was kind of the time period during 2021 and it was, yeah, it was a bit of 2022 as well, I think. They're all wearing masks in school. I did not want to wear masks, so I didn't go to school. So I really missed like two years of school. I guess we have fourth year as well, which we can skip in our country and I didn't do that. So we sh straight into fifth year and then in fifth year, I left for like a month, month and a half, two months. I went back. So this year, my final year was really only my full year I did in school, which is crazy. My only full year that I didn't drop out. <laughs> I basically dropped out of school twice, for anyone that doesn't know. And it's just crazy, because thinking back at then, I was like, I hate this shit, I'm never gonna be done, it's gonna take ages, but no. I'm done school, I'm moving on to the next chapter in my life. I just wanna spread a little message as well about school. You know, I heard Andrew Tate saying this before, that you mightn't like school, but I guess there is positive sides to it too. You know, you're surrounded by your friends every day, you can have a laugh. I guess school teaches you well how to have manners, how to have respect, how to listen instead of talking all the time. You know, it teaches you basic rules like how to dress nice, you know, how to present yourself properly. People get so caught up in thinking, oh, school is shit, school is shit, that they don't think of these positive aspects. And I tried to always think of positive aspects before, but to be honest, I hated it so much that I didn't want to. My opinions in school has always been the same, and I always will be the same. I don't think you should trust the school. I don't think you should look. If you want, I say this to everyone, if you want to do an apprenticeship, if you want to be a lawyer, if you want to be a doctor, if you want to do them regular jobs, go ahead, do it. If you want to work in a shop, go ahead, do it. Not my problem. But for me, that's not what I want to do. And for what I want to do, school is not going to help me. College is not going to help me. Working a nine to five is not going to help me. I don't understand why people get so angry when I give my opinion about this. I'm only giving my opinion I'm only trying to help the younger generation and people my age as well. Even open up people's eyes who are older than me. Some people say it to me, it's like, they think that I'm like 20 years, 10 years ahead of my time, 20 years ahead of my time. It's because how I speak, how I present myself, and I guess my knowledge as well. I guess as well, the school life is just, it's shit. You're talking to your classmates, having a laugh with your classmates, you get in trouble. You pull out your phone, you get in trouble. You're stuck in this room all day, and you can't do anything, you have to do the work, and if you don't, you get in trouble. If you don't do your homework, you get in trouble. Now, thankfully, we didn't have homework for the last two years. People might look at me and be like, man, you're only 17, you don't know anything about life. But I guess, underneath it all, they don't know anything about my life. I know what I've been through in life. I know my actual knowledge as well in life. People don't know, people are just gonna look at me. People just comment on what they see. I guess you could say I'm a dropout. At least, at least I get to say to my future kids, I was a dropout. I don't think many people can say that they completed school and dropped out two times. It's kind of cool to look back on all the times in school and the fact that that's come to an end now. It's, it's, I don't find it one bit emotional or, you know, upsetting. I don't give a fuck really, but it's, cr it is, it is still weird. It's weird the fact to say that I'm done school because you get used to going into summer holidays and you're going back in a few months time in three four months time but the fact that I had I can say now I will never be going back to school ever again in my life it's low-key a nice feeling <laughs>